Schoolboy footballers trapped in a cave in Thailand for 13 days have been invited by FIFA to attend the World Cup final, providing they get out in time. Rescue teams, including Thai Navy SEALs and volunteers from across the world, are battling to free the youngsters from the flooded cave. The boys, aged between 11 and 16, and their 25-year-old coach remain in good spirits despite being trapped in the chamber since June 23. But with their potential path out of the cave currently submerged, there are fears they could be stuck there for weeks or even months. Now, FIFA have given the boys a boost by inviting them to the World Cup final in Moscow on Sunday July 15, providing they're out and well enough to travel. Thailand's FA said FIFA President Gianni Infantino sent the invitation on Thursday, and posted a copy of his letter on its Facebook page. Mr Infantino wrote, if, as we all hope, they are reunited with their families in the coming days and their health allows them to travel, FIFA would be delighted to invite them to attend the 2018 World Cup final in Moscow as our guests. I sincerely hope that they will be able to join us at the final which will undoubtedly be a wonderful moment of communion and celebration. The schoolboys and their football coach disappeared on June 23rd when they were exploring the cave in northern Chiang Rai province. They were found inside a chamber on Monday after spending nine days underground. Footage of the rescue operation showed one of the boys wearing a Red England away shirt, while another was seen in the blue of Chelsea. More than 120 million liters of water has been pumped out of the Tham Luang Caves in Chiang Rai province so far. Doctors, medics and counselors visited the Wild Boar football team, along with Thai Navy SEAL divers, to give them medicines and food. Experts say divers have required three hours to reach the boys, located about 2.5 miles from the mouth of the cave. Rescue teams have been giving the group crash courses in swimming and diving as they prepare to get them out safely. Officials have dismissed speculation that the boys could be trapped for up to four months, although supplies have been prepared for that period of time. Around 30 divers in wetsuits were seen preparing kit and heading for the caves on Wednesday, accompanied by military personnel and a foreign cave expert. A video released by the SEALs showed two rescuers seated on an elevated part of the cave beside boys wrapped in emergency foil blankets who appeared to be in good spirits, occasionally laughing. A torch is shown on each boy, who says hello and introduces himself with head bowed and palms pressed together in a traditional way greeting. The group was discovered by the SEALs and two British cave diving experts, firefighter Rick Stanton and IT consultant John Volanton on Monday after vanishing on June 23rd, when a post-practice outing went awry. Hundreds of personnel were involved in the vast search effort. A former Thai Navy SEAL diver was killed during the rescue mission. Tragic Simon Coonan, 38, died from a lack of oxygen as he left air tanks along a potential exit route.